Hello everyone and welcome to another Timeless video. So today we're going to be taking a look at Jeskai Breach deck in Timeless format. This one's going to be a little bit special. So this deck actually comes from Greenwire again. Greenwire has been sharing a lot of decks with me. They've actually speed ran to Mythic this season after going 14 and 5 with this deck in best of 3. Pretty impressive. And that's with having a high MMR um, after finishing rank 46 last season as well. So I'm actually very thrilled to actually check this deck out because this one looks pretty unique. And of course, if you guys also have some deck suggestions, you have a pet deck that you have that you want to share with me that has been doing pretty well in the latter. Either you write it in the comments below or you can also use that Discord link below and post it in the channel there. But going back to the topic, this one looks very interesting. There's probably a lot of cards that you've never seen before. So let's talk about the cards and how the combo works in this deck. So first of all, we have three copies of Enhanced Surveillance. Now this is an enchantment that you've probably never seen before. So basically what this does is whenever you surveil, you get to basically surveil two additional time. That means with the Dragon Rage Channeler, you get to surveil three at a time, putting three cards into the graveyard. Which means if you pair this up with the Underworld Breach, every time you play a Mistress Bobble onto the battlefield, you have to exile three cards from Breach, but you also put three cards with the Enhanced Surveillance. So you basically repeat this process until you have milled the entire deck, which means you can now play Thassa's Oracle that you have also milled and then just straight up win the game. So combo itself is actually pretty simple, but getting there might be a little bit difficult, of course, because your opponent is also going to be playing Magic at the same time. But why we're suddenly trying this deck out now is because we actually got some new cards from MKM, particularly the lands. We have Meticulous Archive and Thundering Falls in this deck that we can fetch and make abuse of the Enhanced Surveillance. And because we're also putting more surveil cards into the deck, because now land also surveils as well, so we're also playing another card that we can abuse called Thoughtbound Phantasm. This is another card you probably have never seen before if you haven't played Guilds of Ravnica. This has Defender, and it's also a 2-2. Whenever you surveil, you put a plus one plus one counter on this card. So because of Defender, it can't attack, but if you put three or more counters on this card, now this can attack as if it didn't have Defender. So this is a card is going to keep growing with cards such as Consider, Dragon Ray Chandler, and now we have the lands as well. So I'm actually very excited to try this deck out. So having said that, I'm going to be hopping over to some Timeless Mess of 3 to show you guys what it does. So let's hop on over. Ooh, we're playing against Yorion. Fantastic hand. By the way, if you haven't noticed, this deck actually doesn't play Brainstorm, which is kind of interesting because... We're trying to take advantage of all the surveil mechanics, so... This actually replaces the Brainstorm, which is a bit interesting. I think we're just going to attack here with Consider Up. And of course, a counter spell as well. Okay, opponents, uh, this is probably five colors, I'm guessing. Oh, wow. I think I'm supposed to actually take that. Yep. Source to Plowshare. I'll just consider again. A spell pierce. Hmm, I'm actually kind of looking for a land, so let's just do that. Same with the bauble.
I'm guessing this is a control deck, a five color control deck. Nice, we found the land. Okay, we found another land. I think it's just a counter spell. Consider to my hand and do this again. We do need a fourth land, but... Maybe we, we actually take it because we can do double counter spell next turn. So this deck actually wants um, exactly four lands to combo because... Um, well, that's after you have the Dragon Rage Hunter on the battlefield. We'll pass. We haven't seen our, like, other than the first Dragon Race Chandler, we haven't seen our one drops. Like the Thoughtbound Phantasm, Dragon Race Chandler. It's a bit unfortunate. Minsk and Boo. Let me see what we got here. Another land? Nope. That's also a nope. Just counter it. Oh, wow. Okay, so I think I was going to say I think we won, but I actually don't have any Dragon Rage Hunters yet, which is a shame. We'll pass. That was such a good opportunity. If a Dragon Rage Hunter was actually in the graveyard, we could have actually won there. That would have been perfect. Um, I guess we could like force out a counter. What if I just use Underworld Breach just as um a value? So this is actually gonna force out their counter spell, and then we're going to unholy heat the Yoko. Invert the world to watch kings grovel. One bite, and all your cares are gone. I see you don't share my vision. Yeah, I could just breach. I could get like double Mishra's bauble. I think it's not a bad idea, actually. Yeah, I don't think it's actually a bad idea. They're gonna draw a land. Let's see what we're gonna draw. Maybe we draw like a counter spell. A spell pierce. I don't think that's good enough. Yeah, I don't think that's good enough. Okay. Um... We do need this enhanced surveillance, actually. Draw a little bit more. 
I mean, this is just so much value. Uh, I could do it again if I wanted to. Should I just do it again? I mean, I'm already drawing like three cards. There's the Dragon Rage Chandler. One ring, okay. Uh, can I win? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we can't, okay. Okay. The thing is, we actually have Thassa's Oracle in hand. So that actually might just kind of win us the game too. Like if, if we deck out, like we only have 28 cars remaining. Very interesting first game. I wonder what this trigger is. Really? You want to get rid of this? Huh. Uh, sure? Kind of unexpected, actually. Yeah, very unexpected. We'll still keep this. Um... And we'll pass. Yeah, so bizarre not going after Dragon Rage Chandler. Okay, that's fine. Ah, oh, man, another source of plowshare. Very annoying. Very, very annoying. Counter spell. Their second counter spell. Um, I guess I'm just. Yeah, actually, let's let's see what we get on top. Okay. I should have actually um look at our own deck because they had double fetch lands. They're looking for a way to kill the Loris at the moment. Um Oh wow. We actually can't play the swords. Well played, well played. Did we play another white spell last turn? How did it tap all three, three of my white sources? Oh, I think this is the one I fetched. They're gonna duress. They're gonna take away the swords. We're so close to winning. They already used double counter spell. I don't think they play... They probably don't play more counter spells than that. It, it this seems more of a mid range than a control. Now that I look at it. Oh, another land. We're dead.
a bit, bit unfortunate, I, w I would say. Okay, let's have a spell pierce. Um, uh, maybe a pithing needle as well for like one ring, planeswalkers, things like that. I think that's about it. I got a ledger shredder and swords. I think we'll uh, call it a day. So when we need something like a uh, dragon ray challenger on the battlefield, it's really tough. You know, it's really tough. So we got Thoughtbound Phantasm start. Very interesting that they played the rest of the main deck. Okay, this is kind of gas. Or are we setting up Enhanced Surveillance? Ooh, that's actually... I think we are, actually. Okay. Here we go. See if they want to get rid of my Thoughtbound Phantasm. Okay, Fatal Push online. That's fine. Is it actually not Phantasm turn and rather Dragon Rage Chandler and flip it? Since they don't have a Bowmaster mana right now. Land creature. Instant speed. I think we just bottom all of them and try to look for a way to flip this thing. Breach. Breach. Nice. So we won if this uh, Dragon Ray Chandler survives. That is a big if. No, my breach. They might actually get rid of the express iteration. If they don't know the combo, they get they get rid of the express iteration. But if they do, they get rid of breach. Let's see what they got. No, my precious, my precious. into a binding. I mean they got they gotta get rid of a uh, Dragon Ray Chandler. How dare they Okay One land. So again, because they took a Dragon Ray Chandler. So rude. This isn't a fight you can win. Land. Land and we win. Land and we win. Come on. Give me a land. Give me a land! Oh, that is so unfortunate. It's crazy. I think we still um, try to go for it because this is a lot of value. Yeah, this is still like insane value, so we, we still go for this. And we look for um, the last breach, I guess. 
they got an Elko there. Oh, we're about to get rid of a Thassa's Oracle, though. I think we have to. So, our win condition is gone, but we're gonna draw a lot of cards. That's the idea. It'd be funny if they had a Bowmaster on top of it, too. Then we just, you know, we can't deal with that. So I'm just kind of hoping they don't have anything in their hand. <laughs> you know. Some miracle for for like that to happen, but I, th I think this is a pretty sh good showcase um, of what the Thoughtbound Phantasm could do if um, the combo plan is gone. Eleven cards. Um, I don't think we can actually. I think we're just gonna mill out, right? So no Bowmaster, that's fantastic, but... We do have a situation, right? We do have a bit of a situation. We have two cars remaining, so we gotta end the game fast. We gotta end the game very fast. Oh wow, they're giving me a turn. That's kind of huge. Because I'm going to have double counter spell. They're shocking themselves. Okay, we have more chance than we should. We we sh we have more chance than we should, honestly. Because they uh, because the opponents shock themselves and they're taking damage from one ring. This is fantastic. If I just left one more card back, I think I would have been a lot happier. We could also exile this and shuffle it away now that I think about it. Oh, yeah. Yes. We have way more shots. Okay. There's a surveil land in the graveyard as well. I think I'm just going to bottom all the... All of these away. Opponent takes a damage. We have three counter spells. Okay, this is it, our final, our final straw. Oh my god, if we actually win this one, I'd be so happy. I actually would be so happy.
Okay, opponent passes. That's fine. Maybe I should have cracked the Mistress Bauble. So I think the plan here is... I'm going to crack the Surveillance. Shuffle it. Hoping we draw another counter spell, maybe? Oh, no, no, no. If I actually shuffle this, the Dragon Ray Chandler is going to lose the um, Delirium. So we actually have to be wary of that. Wow, we actually won! Jeez! That was actually insane. Wait, my opponent left? Why? What? Well... This might be a mistake, but... We'll see. Once upon a time... What? Oh, wait, what? Um... A... a zoo deck? Ledger Shredder. Ledger Shredder. Um... Let's go. Please don't be a bolt. Why is everybody playing Swords today? What happened? Oh no, they have a binding as well. It's pretty annoying. That's actually pretty annoying. It's like, it's a five color deck again? How? So this is an Oko turn, right? Could be a Brainstorm, or Oko, or Leyline. I'll keep that. 500%. I mean, I guess it's rank reset. So a lot of people want to try non-meta decks. I can understand. Let's set up an enhanced surveillance with the counter spell up. I don't I doubt they're going to counter this, right? Like I just don't see it. What? Would you really counter this? Okay, well, fine. I mean, this is clearly a bait, right? They want to set up a... Like an Omnath or something. Nice! Unholy heat? I kinda would like that. Oh man. 
I guess I want Spell Pierce instead. Yeah, I'd rather have a Spell Pierce. Thank you very much. Yeah, we're all fine. I think I might not consider... As now, especially considering they have um that thing. Thoughtbound Phantasm? I'll take it. I'll take it. They're just gonna play their Uro though. Maybe I shouldn't have taken this. Omnath, okay. Do they not play anything that can be pierced? We don't need another one. We don't need that either. They're drawing all land. Oh. Is the Enhanced Surveillance exiled? No, it's not, right? It's in the graveyard. Okay, so... We need 7 mana to win the game. Kind of brave of them to actually not tap the Delighted Halfling to cast the Uro there. Um, what if I pierce just to surveil? Is that wrong? Let's actually just pierce to surveil. I know this this thing doesn't get. Oh, there you go. That's good. Every tale about me is absolute nonsense. And absolutely true. They have to make our Dragon Rage Chandler into a 3 3. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, they made it bigger. Um, I wish I had another Dragon Rage Chandler. Okay, so. Uro's gone. Let's kill the Oko. May we meet again, or not? Maybe I should just breach. Play a bunch of Mistress Bauble. Yeah, maybe. I think I'm just going to breach, actually. Potentially set up combo.
And then we toss his Oracle and win the game next turn. I think that's the play. Because I don't think their deck plays counter spells. Also, we could also have a backup counter spell as well. They're drawing a ley line. Yeah, we just have a counter spell up for next turn and we win the game. It'll be funny if they actually have a Thought Seize though. That'd be so funny. What if I have like double counter spell? Yeah, maybe that's it. Now we're drawing eight. That's good enough. So we win next turn, hopefully. Bit of an all-in play, though. My last card. Yeah, that's fine. I wonder if they can, like, forcefully let us draw. Another thrilling adventure! We will stomp out evil! Bigger is always, always better. Okay, my turn. GG's. Why is everybody playing five colors right now? I wonder. Uh, Pithing Needle, Spell Pierce, and I got a Ledger Shredder. What's the last cut? Maybe honestly a Counter Spell. Since I have things like the Light of Halfling, I don't think Counter Spell is going to be like as good compared to Spell Pierce, right? Spell Pierce still gets to counter Sorcery Speed and Instant Speeds. Okay, yeah, this one looks very safe. Very, very safe. I wonder if they play um, a Bowmaster. Um... Uh, always bolt the bird, right? Another alternative I think I could have done is... I play Dragon Rage Hunter, prepare for Oko, and try to get the Delirium and kill it with the Unholy Heat. I think that was also an option as well. Swords. So annoying. Come on. A needle. Okay, um, let's needle. We're gonna call Minx Gambu because Oko didn't come out last turn.
Brainstorm. Pick your poison? Okay, so that, that means they must have it. I can't grab the white land. I need I need double I need double red. I need double red. No way. Leave my Dragon Raid Chandlers alone! What is this? It's actually mega annoying. Spell Pierce? I guess that could be good. Because I, I want to fetch the Loris back into my hand next turn. Also, how do we still not have Delirium? Unlicensed hers. Uh, sure. It's actually not the end of the world that they got a unlicensed hers because we can still win the game if we just mill, right? Got like, they just... Double swords and a binding. Pretty annoying. Thoughtbound Phantasm. But it sucks that our unholy heat is now useless. Maybe I shouldn't have topped the spell pierce. Right. That is so interesting they did that. Are they gonna attack me? That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Okay, our hand is obnoxiously bad. Once upon a time. We need a Dragon Ray Chandler, man. Very good spell pierce. Opponent's probably regretting not casting the Oko first. Oh my god. What a godlike card to top deck there. Oh, it's so good. Saved? Oh my gosh, we're we're totally in this now. We are totally in this now. Just like that. Um, that. Okay, that's a bit annoying. They're so good at drawing swords. It's insane. What is this? 
we're pretty good at drawing swords too. Apparently. Ow. Oracle? The thing is... If I don't draw the Oracle... Isn't that bad? That's bad for us, right? Let's actually hold back. I don't think they're gonna attack, but... There's a good chance. Wait, really? Really? What if I exile this, actually? Shuffle? Because I, I don't want to draw Thassa's Oracle, right? Actually, but Seiju also shuffled. Okay, never mind. That was pretty bad. Although, Consider is a great card to get. A land? I need a white land so I can play the Loris. 8 damage? Like, do they play Bolt? I mean, their deck has to play Bolt, right? Breach is not it. Okay, now we're attacking for sure. Enhance Surveillance? Okay, I'll take that. I will gladly take that. See what they draw. A land, thank god. Now we can safely attack. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, this card is absolute gas in this deck. It's, it's a one mana card, like... Have you ever seen a one mana card deal 8 damage? So... They're dead no matter what, right? Yeah. So opponent's dead no matter what. Nice. Okay. Okay, this hand is pretty gas. I do wonder though. Okay, we're playing against... Okay, 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 okay. Okay, perfect. The land was actually perfect. Uh, three mana card... Okay, that's fine. I think we just hold up counter spell. Can Castle Garen Break generate a green mana? What about this? Okay, one mana of the chosen color. I think we pass with the counter spell up. Because of this card. Do we let them have this? I think we let them have this. And then we counter spell. Oh, interesting. Okay. Well, that does kind of change things a bit. Once upon a time, so they... What? Okay, well, well they got... They got the Titan now. Um... Really? I 
I don't need expressive iteration. We basically need um, delirium for that. Or just draw that, but... I think I'm actually going to draw that, just for swords. Okay... We are one card away from winning. And that is Mistress Bauble. They didn't even tap it right. They're getting two zombies here. Three zombies. Uh, what's my play here? I'm gonna be enhanced surveillancing into an unholy heat, perhaps. Maybe just consider as well. I, I think I'm, I'm going to top this one. Uh, set up surveillance. Um, we don't need double white. Bobble. Okay, next turn we win the game. Next turn, we win the game. Okay, honestly, I didn't even know it did this, by the way. What is a stop? Oh no, they have Arch Archdruid's Charm again. So they're gonna get rid of the Enhanced Surveillance. Oh, that's really bad. Why? So we don't have the combo anymore. Do we have another Enhanced Surveillance somewhere? That's pretty annoying actually. I'm um, taking 7 here. We might actually want this. That's pretty annoying. Counter spell really doesn't do anything right now. I guess that would be pretty nice. Oh. Okay, now we're cooking. We need to draw land. This is 2-4. Really? Gotta find the land. Otherwise we lose.
You're kidding me. That's your last card? They're gonna grab Bajuka Bug and we lost the game. Oh, they grabbed a Baseju. That's insane! My opponent's actually insane right now. I think we have to breach. Is there a breach, an extra breach in this? Okay, so. We're gonna have to breach. Um, let's go with Shredder. Then we'll get rid of this. Another channeler. Nope. <laughs> okay, now we have to bring back Loris. I wonder if I can actually win, though. Probably not. I think I... I see the line. We played Loras, and we win next turn. We win next turn. What a game. Yeah, they played in a fashion that they actually... It, it, it does feel like they actually know our deck quite well. That's very- that's very interesting. Opponent knows our deck quite well. What do we even board? Maybe Spell Pierce? Or Archer Charm? Like, this doesn't do anything, Stern Scolding doesn't do anything, Invasive Surgery doesn't do anything. I think we keep all the removal spells, though. Might be a Dotbound Phantasm. Ho. Ho ho ho. So this is like what? Um, we're looking at one, two, three, and then we're drawing a land on our turn. So that's four looks at a land. And then the second turn comes, that's five. We're drawing, we're looking at top five cars to find a land, basically. I think I'll go with that, actually. It does really suck that we can't take advantage of the Mistress Bauble with the Dragonry Chandler, but I think this is still okay. No. Help. You can't do this to me. You can't do this to me. Oh. Well, that is a land, but... 
It's not the land that we're looking for. So it's useless. Oh? I think opponent has a Poseidon. you. That's a lot of Dragon Ray Chandlers, I'm not gonna lie. That is a lot of Dragon Ray Chandlers. No! How oh, dare you. Should I still do it? I don't know. I mean, it, it forces them to use their blast cell next turn. I don't think that's even that good. Is it not? Should I bait it out? I'm gonna bait it out. Gonna bait it out. I shouldn't have played this. What am I doing? It's so bad. Fine. Okay, so they're they're trying to blast zone. Okay, that's fine. That's that's fine. Counter spell? That's very nice, actually. That is very, very nice. I mean, I don't think they can even blast zone, to be fair. Can they blast zone? Wow. Sacrificing... a land is actually... very detrimental. I'll draw that, thank you very much. Crater Hope. I often do this a lot. Like, how am I misplaying so hard? How do I still not have a second blue source? A uh, second white source for Loris. How, how, how? I mean, that is, uh, that is a white source for Loris, but do I want to really top that? Do I really want to top that? Yes, I do. So unfortunately, we actually don't have a Hallowed Fountain in the um, in the deck anymore. We we only have um, a Tap Land. So we'll see how this one goes. Um, yeah, that's fine. reach. Did I win? Not quite. But I think we we still top that.
I, I think we still go for it because we have double Dragon Rage Chandler. Why are you always backwards, man? So we try to win next turn, get lost, fine. Um, am I gonna die next turn? I don't think so, right? I don't think they can kill me. Yeah, I don't think they can kill me. So we have effectively won the game. Unless they can deal 9 damage. They didn't accidentally exile my Asa's Oracle, right? That would be devastating. <laughs> So that's 10. 10 cards remaining. We're drawing 4. We're drawing 4. 7 cards remaining. Hold up. Uh, if I mill 2, that's 5 cards remaining. So this, this would be lethal. So we stop here. Uh, just in case, let's kill this thing. And we end the turn. Here we go. Yeah, they're they're dead. GG's. GG's.